Five reasons why to let go of ego. Ego is your enemy. It makes your life harder. It ruins your relationships. It makes you arrogant and selfish, right? Well, yes and no. Today we're talking about five reasons why you need to let go of ego and the negative sides of having ego. This is part two of my video series about ego. In the first video, I shared with you five initial reasons why everyone, every one of us needs ego. The universe, nature, the force of life or God did not make a mistake by giving us ego. Before destroying your ego, make sure to watch the first video so you can make a wise decision about the type of actions you should take. Today we are talking about how our ego can make our lives miserable and completely destroy our relationships. Let's start. My name is Elena Semenek, I'm a psychologist and a life coach. I offer online private sessions and I'm a creator of multiple healing courses. This is my YouTube channel, Psychology of Happiness. Welcome! On this channel, I help you to boost your self-confidence, to overcome your insecurities, and to guide you in creating loving, profound relationships. Every week, I release a new video about self-esteem, relationships, anxieties, limiting beliefs, and all other essential topics that will guide you to manifest all of your dreams. Start watching my videos one by one. I have 500 plus of them on my channel. And I guarantee that sooner than you expect, you will become a happier, healthier, and more successful person. Subscribe to my channel, click the bell to turn on the notifications so you won't miss my next important video. Okay, let's talk about negative sides of ego. Before we're going to talk about it, let's briefly remind ourselves the definition of ego. So what is ego? Ego is a person's perception of self-esteem and self-importance. Ego is your own opinion of your self-worth. Basically, this is how highly you think about yourself. So let's talk about why we need to let go of ego. Reason number one is ego is protecting us from being vulnerable. It protects us from feeling shame. You might say that this looks like a good thing, but in reality, ego does a bad favor for us. Let me explain. When we make a mistake, we often feel embarrassed. Our ego tries to minimize our feelings by suppressing them and pretending that what happened is not important. As a result, we cannot learn from our mistakes. And sometimes a mistake can be very small and easy to fix. But because we have ego that protecting us from feeling bad, our ego convinces us to ignore our feelings and to not take accountability for our actions. Because we ignore and minimize the consequences of our mistakes, we might hurt some people. And sometimes a simple apology can help us to connect to a person, but instead we pretend that nothing happened or act like the other person is making a big fuss out of nothing. So instead of learning how to be resilient, how to have a strong connection with ourselves and with other people, our ego protects us and does not allow us to be authentic. Ego tells us that everything is great and everything is okay. And that often makes us emotionally cold and unavailable. If you're new to my channel and if you enjoyed this video, then take advantage and grab my free healing tools. I'm happy to send you five free self-development webinars, five free guided meditations, and five free healing exercises. Visit elenasemanek.com slash free or click the link below the video. Actually, you know what? Stop the video. 
Submit your request for my free self-development tools right now and then continue watching the video so you won't forget about it later. Do it right now. Did you do it? Okay. Reason number two why we need to let go of ego is Ego can switch our priorities in life. Let's say you are trying to save some money for a down payment to buy a house. At the same time, you see that one of your friends bought a nice car and he is very proud about his purchase. Now you are thinking that you also deserve a nice car. You've been saving for a long time, but the housing prices are going up. So, instead of following your true desire to buy a house, your ego starts a game of who has a better car, you or your friend. And then you start believing a false idea that the new car will make you happy. And maybe you should stop thinking about buying a house, but enjoy your life right now and buy yourself a new car. So your ego likes to play this comparison game and it often brings us further and further away from our true goals. As a result, we don't feel satisfied. We don't feel happy even after we receive the things that we thought would make us happy. Making comparison is one of the most detrimental things for our self-esteem and self-confidence. I have a video, 5 tips on how to overcome inferiority complex. Make sure to watch it. If you catch yourself that someone else is better, smarter or deserve more than you, then you must watch my video on overcoming inferiority complex. I am going to leave the link in the comments. Also, if you want to become a confident and successful person, Join my online happiness club today. Take advantage of my special offer that you can find in the video description. Join my happiness club and receive instant access to my entire database of healing exercises, guided meditations, self-development webinars, life coaching techniques, breathing exercises, art therapy, energy work, and my personal support. And by the way, in my happiness club, members can enroll into three online courses for free. Number one, healing your inner child. Two, overcoming emotional eating. And three, program yourself for success. You can have a life that you can be proud of. Visit elenasamenek.com slash happiness. Let's continue talking about five reasons why you need to let go of ego. The first reason was ego makes us suppress our feelings and therefore does not allow us to learn from our mistakes. Reason number two was that ego is switching our priorities and putting us further and further away from our real desires. And here we come to reason number three. So reason number three why you need to let go of ego is ego tells you that you must always be right. Ego is extremely sensitive to any type of criticism. Therefore, it does not allow us to accept another person's opinion. It does not even allow us to hear the opinion of another person when they disagree with us. Ego makes us interrupt the conversation, it makes us argue and be rude to others. Our ego is protecting us by pushing away other people. And if we keep letting our ego be in control, one day we might end up lonely and feel that no one understands us. Let's move on. Reason number four why you need to let go of ego is Ego makes us arrogant, rude, selfish, and disrespectful to others. When ego is suspecting that another person might be right, it becomes defensive. Our ego makes us devalue another person by putting them down. 
It makes us rude and say offensive words and act disrespectfully. When we realize that we hurt another person, it's usually too late. The harmful words were already spoken. We might apologize, but the next time when we feel vulnerable, our ego comes back with an even stronger force. And again, we might say some ugly words and show a nasty attitude. And for that, I have another video, which is called six true reasons why people are rude, angry and disrespectful. And in most cases, it is not because the person is bad or has bad manners. Some of these true reasons will shock you. And some of these reasons will help you to understand yourself better. I will leave the link in the video description and somewhere here. Let's talk about the final and the most important reason why you need to let go of ego is because your ego always wants more. It is good to desire more things in life. It motivates us to learn new skills, to meet new people or to find new opportunities. But when our ego is too big, it becomes a problem. Ego can never be satisfied with what we have. Therefore, we devalue our own achievements. We do not appreciate what we have. And as a result, we feel that we are not good enough. Ego tells us that we need more and more and more. We spend a lot of energy, a lot of time to satisfy our ego's expectations. But once we achieve our goal, our ego is not happy and it convinces us that we need to work even harder. We feel exhausted. We feel that no matter what we do, it is not enough. And it is never enough. Our ego creates unrealistic expectations and does not allow us to enjoy our relationships. On one hand, uh, ego tells us that we are better than everyone else. On the other hand, ego tells us that we are not good enough. We criticize ourselves and we criticize others. Ego is constantly telling us that we need more and more things. It does not appreciate but actually minimize the value of what we already have. We cannot connect to our true feelings. We cannot connect to our true desires and we cannot enjoy what we have. We cannot be authentic and we cannot create loving, caring and profound relationships. All of us have ego and my ego is dying right now to know if this video was helpful to you. And if yes, then let me know in the comments and give me a like. Share this video on your social media. It will take you only a few seconds, but it means a lot for my ego. So do it right now. Ego can destroy our lives and our relationships, and yet we still need our ego. And I encourage you to watch my video about five reasons, five essential reasons why we need ego. Before deciding to let go of your ego completely, watch that video. Ego is a tool. Once you know how to use it, you can become the master of your own happiness. Life is not black and white. It is full of colors. I encourage you to see the good sides of ego and to be aware of its negative influences. And then you can make a wise decision of what to do next. Also, check my video about five tips on how to overcome inferiority complex and six true reasons why people are rude, angry and disrespectful. Start watching my videos one by one. I have 500 plus of them on my channel. I guarantee that sooner than you expected, you will become happier, healthier, and create amazing, loving, and caring relationships in your life. Subscribe to my channel, click the link to turn on the notification so you won't miss my next important video. And now go and watch the other videos right now. All the links are in the description. Bye.